welcome on the hands on time my name is Mal and I'm doing watch reviews for you um, so I'm um, by advance you know sorry uh, not to have uh, posted you know vi videos for a long time but like I said I'm doing two in a row right now I had the COVID-19 for the second time and it was really hard for me to recover so uh, I'm back and uh, today uh, the topic of today is about this brand Briston okay so Briston is a wonderful brand that is coming to us from France okay my country uh, and um, they are doing like you know really really wonderful watches and I needed to have to put my hand on one and to talk to you about uh, this uh, brand so uh, what about this brand this brand is all about the founder isn't it so the founder uh, is called Brice Jaunet okay so Brice Jaunet um, had worked you know for um, uh, the watch industry for a long time so during those years he worked in both the world's largest watchmaking groups starting with Richmond okay he worked with Richmond the guy that uh, is selling this watch worked with Richmond where he worked at which department the Cartier department so look at the background of this guy he worked at on the group Richmond for the Cartier the Cartier sorry department he then worked at Beaumont Mercier. I don't know if you know about Beaumont Mercier, but Beaumont Mercier is a, like a wonderful French watch company, uh, watches that would cost you an arm, and continued his career internationally for Raymond Vell. Okay? He eventually joined uh, LVMH Group as export director for Venice, Venice watches, then as a vice president in international marketing. Uh, he then assumed the management of the brand in France. So, and uh, you know, a long story short, after that, uh, in uh, 2012, he set out with several Swiss designer friends to create a watch brand that reflected his personality, his thoughts, um, and um, his thoughts, sorry, and his research. Brice Jaunet wanted to create a beautiful and authentic yet affordable timepiece, and he, he clearly did. Okay, so isn't that crazy like uh, this guy the background of this guy is uh, Cartier in the Richmond group Beaumont Mercier even Venice Venice watches like his background is crazy 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 background for uh, for this guy Brice Jaunet that created a wonderful a wonderful timepiece and we are going to talk about it so that's it for uh, the history of the brand the cost how much did i pay for this watch so for this watch this the watch that i'm gonna you know unbox for you today i paid one uh, it retails at 190 euros okay for this one this is the, the quartz version but it can go up to uh, i think 500 okay 500 for an automatic watch so let's open this case and let's see what's inside so as you can see they are giving you a pouch a pouch a wonderful pouch and that's wonderful you know because boxes you, you cannot travel with but this you can you know actually travel with so what else is in the box you have the wonderful NATO so it comes with this wonderful NATO strap that I didn't choose you know to to let on the on the watch and this is uh, the reference number okay of the watch let me zoom it for you so this is the reference number if that's the watch you're you're interested in it okay reference number is here and they are giving you uh, not a tool this tool came with the bracelet I choose to put on it and they are giving you you know a little leaflet like this that um, talks about you know all the watches so as you can see you have beautiful chronographs like you can see you have automatic watches as well they are not you know only using this matter around the cases you also have um, stainless steel as you can see let me show you an automatic one so this is an automatic watch from Briston beautiful automatic watch they are even using wood look at this automatic watch this is made the dial is made out of wood and it's crazy they are really really doing wonderful and uh, watches and of course you know uh, the history of uh, the history uh, a brief history of the company okay so let's open um, the rest of it and let's see what's inside and of course you have uh, also the, the warranty card inside so let's put everything inside and let's unveil what I have to show to you today so there you go this is the watch that I put on uh, a gold mesh Okay, uh, strap. 
the specs what are the specs for this beautiful watch so for this beautiful watch they are using uh, tortoise shell acetate so they are using acetate all around the case as you can see uh, so acetate is what uh, you would find find you know on um, ribbon you know ribbon uh, sunglasses or even you know um, the, um, the glasses that uh, they are using to correct your view your eyesight so this is the matter that they are using here acetate and it's I think quite unique and um, Brice Jeunet uh, really tried to find yeah, like the best uh, guy in um, Italy because you know acetate in Italy is a big uh, is a big deal Reban for example Rebans are you know um, fabricated in, in uh, Italy and um, he associated you know with the best to to work on that matter I think that the guy like the master the acetate master you know uh, he um, associated with is called uh, Mazzoletti or Mazzo I forgot I forgot the name but he worked with the best for that so acetate yellow gold PVD treatment so all the gold that you see on the case here around and on the crown is a uh, PVD treatment okay so 40 by 40 the case is 40 millimeters by 40 millimeters inside you have a quartz myota 2315 okay so really good reliable quartz inside if you want an automatic version you have um, automatic versions as well uh, what, I, what else can I say uh, you have um, uh, so the hours the minutes and a date complication as you can see you have three years of duration time for the battery uh, me personally my dial is green olive with sunray finish okay green olive with sunray finish the thickness is 11.70 yeah it looks big but it's not as you can see 11.70 for the thickness okay so wonderful thickness for um, this beautiful watch what else can I say the crystal is domed okay and it's um, 2.3 millimeters of thickness so you have a dome crystal I don't know if we we can catch it here and the thickness of the crystal is 2.3 millimeters so the hands are rhodium plated baton we say baton in France uh, hands with uh, white superluminova inserts so you have loom on this watch and it's uh, superluminova so it's a good uh, quality of loom a hundred meters of water resistance okay what that means that means that you can actually swim with this watch okay as crazy as, as it looks because this watch really looks like a dress watch or like a like a chic you know type of a, of watch but you, you can actually you know swim with this watch it's crazy uh, and of course you have the NATO that I show you showed you before you know gold NATO signed with the Briston here and green goes with the green of the of the dial okay so uh, I think that that's uh, that's it for the specs uh, yeah the strap width would be 20 sorry 20 millimeters for the strap and you have a two years warranty an international warranty that uh, you know in contrast of uh, Chinese watches is actually working you know with uh, this type of company so there you go these uh, were the specs of this beautiful Briston wonderful watch that uh, really looks like a Panerai and um, like Panerai you know you have this sandwich dial type of uh, design okay it's as you can see it gives some um, really um, depth to the dial so I think that that's it for the spec the good and the bad what's good what's bad about this watch so um, I have nothing else to say but good things about this watch honestly there's no nothing bad you know about this watch the sandwich dial uh, the way they um, they created the, the date complication uh, yeah it looks like a Panerai but it's absolutely not a Panerai uh, the name of the watch the Clubmaster uh, the um, what they choose you know this let me tell you what this watch is um, make me you know makes me thinks of I imagine a man you know with a cigar and a good whiskey you know in a, in a I don't know a beautiful you know lounge uh, bar uh, with a three-piece suit on himself and um, a Panama as a hat you know that's what this uh, this watch m makes me think think about you know it's crazy uh, because uh, 
there's no not a lot of watches that would make me think of anything you know but this watch makes me think about you yeah you know uh, an old man with a cigar and a uh, and a good whiskey on his uh, on his hand so uh, that's what this watch makes me think about uh, what else can i say about this watch is like the acetate the, the acetate around makes it um, a unique piece because the piece of acetate that you will have around your watch will, will not be the same you know it's uh, all the time a unique piece that they are using. Uh, me, on, on my copy, I mean personally the PVD gold all around with the sand crown uh, that is made out of, um, of, um, of PVD gold as well is really crazy. It's, it's beautiful. Everything, everything is, um, is PVD treated on this watch. Even the back and trust me or not because I'm not going to show you but the, um, the pumps are even gold. The pumps, you know, uh, in here that is under uh, the strap or um, PVD gold as well so I have nothing else to say you know about this watch the, the club master name that they choose is wonderful club master you know uh, it's it's really a refined piece you know for casual chic times or even something that you can rock with a suit and it's truly beautiful I mean look at this uh, at this dial and they even put you know uh, some loom super luminova on this watch and you can even swim with it so it's a crazy versatile watch that i have nothing you know bad to say about except that i'm really truly surprised with this brand maybe it's not gonna be for everyone you know but uh me personally i'm in love i'm in love with this brand and i think that one day i'm gonna acquire uh, an automatic watch from briston so really really nice uh brice Jeunet, is really a guy that is yeah French but uh, in love with England and you can really you know feel it on his watches so yeah Brice Jeunet is, uh, is really uh, enamored you know with uh, with the British style uh, and we can see it you know on the on the design and on the creation and you can feel the background of this guy I mean this watch is really really well thought so I have nothing bad to say about this watch how to wear this watch well uh, like i told you you can wear this watch in casual chic times and with a suit uh, i would not go casual you know with this one and there you go for the wrist shot so as you can see i have a 16.5 between 16.5 and a 17 centimeter of circumference and look how it looks I'm trying to zoom it for you it's it's it looks wonderful Really, on this mesh strap, it enhances the, the refinement of this watch, refine style of this watch, and it's, it looks beautiful. The thickness is absolutely mind-blowing, you know. You think it, I thought it would be, it, it would be more, but, but it's not. And it really looks nice. I love this watch. I love this brand and I love this watch and it's a really, really nice surprise. Honestly, looks beautiful. 16.5, I think you can go to even someone with a 16, 16 centimeters of circumference of a wrist could rock this watch with no worries whatsoever. Beautiful, isn't it? Really nice. And there you go for the loom shot. So as you can see, super luminova, the loom is quite good. So that was the second hand passing through um, the minute hand. You see, really powerful and usable. Incredible loom, Super Luminova. It's actual Super Luminova that they use on this watch. And as you can see, <laughs> the loom is uh, it's pretty good. It's not the best loom in the world, but it's not a bad one at all. So that's it for uh, the loom shot. So guys, let's take a moment. So let's zoom on this watch so you can see what I'm talking about. Sandwich type of dial, a little like a, a Panerai. Look at the sandwich dial. It's beautiful. The execution of, um, of, the, of the date window is beautiful. Let me try and zoom it for you. Yeah, you see? Wonderful. Really readable. Don't have a lot of light, I'm sorry. The hands, the Super Luminova on it, Clubmaster 100 meters, Clubmaster 100 meters. Look at the, the Sunray dial, the green, the olive green, beautiful Sunray, Sunburst, 
type of a, of a dial, the brand, Bristol, the acetate. Let me try and show you the acetate. You see it's transparent in here. Maybe your copy wouldn't be like this. I think everyone has a, a unique piece, like I told you, the gold PVD. I need to wash it a little bit. Up, oh, there you go. Gold PVD, beautiful. Let's go and have a look at the back. Briston Clubmaster. You have um, the, um, the reference number of the watch, 100 meter. Swiss design. Yeah, because the design was created in Switzerland, I f um, forgot to tell you. Italian acetate, okay, real Italian acetate and stainless steel. And quartz movement, Mayoda, as I told you, with the um, Briston Clubmaster shield. In the middle of the back, let's have a look at one of the components that I really love, which is the crown. I kept it for the end, look at the crown. With those two like pieces of, um, looks like, um, like rubber. I think it helps with, um, for, you know, grabbing, grabbing the, the crown. And the shield of Briston, really, uh, you know, British inspired with this uh, type of uh, armoire, we say in French, you know, this type of shields. Really, really nice, honestly. Uh, wow, the um, Briston really, really rocks. They're, they're, they are doing beautiful, beautiful pieces. I actually prefer, you know, um, a piece like that uh, to, um, to a Panerai. I'm not a, a huge Panerai fa fan, but I'm a huge Briston fan now. And uh, I really think I need to have, um, to buy myself um, an automatic one as well. Uh, maybe a chronograph, I don't know. So final thoughts, uh, what are my final thoughts? Well, uh, simple, I love the brand, it's wonderful. Uh, it's French, but it's also British, and it's also Italian, and it's also Swiss. I mean, wow, the background of Brice Jeunet is really impressive, you know, someone that worked with Cartier or, or with Beaume and Mercier or Venice. Venice watches could, that was the only guy that could come with a design like this, you know. Wonderful, wonderful design. So if you don't have one in your collection, just go for it. I know it, it won't be for everyone because it's, um, it's really special. The design is really special. But uh, really, I mean, uh, for a watch uh, enthusiast, you, you would need to have a Briston in your watch collection because it's a really, really interesting watch. So uh, like, subscribe, comment. Uh, I'm sorry if I, um, if I was, um, you know, unclear uh, in the video because uh, like I told you, I had the COVID-19 for the second time and I'm just recovering. It's not easy. Uh, so um, like, subscribe, comment if you want. It really helps, you know, us staying on YouTube because, um, well, clearly if you don't, we will disappear, you know. And uh, if you want to help the channel, you have a TP link, you know, on the, um, on the description. So um, do not hesitate to use it, you know. Everything that um, you donate will be used for um, the channel. Even if uh, no one ever did, <laughs> maybe one day someone will. So take care of you guys and stay away, you know, from the disease, uh, the, the, the COVID. It's, it's really, really awful. Okay? Take care of yourself and your families and a lot of love from Paris. Look at this watch. Isn't it marvelous? Really wonderful. Goodbye.